Hi everyone, we are Kelvin here. So we finished B Weekly Contest 5. Let's discuss about the third question. Connecting cities with minimum cost. So we are given list of connections and number of cities. So we are being asked to um, build the road. So every city is connected with the minimum cost. And if it's not possible to build um, all city to be connected, we return a minus one instead. So if we look from the first example, um, we see that here is the list of city that will be that can be connected using options of road and the cost. So um, city one and city two connected with cost five, city one, city three with cost six, city two, city three with cost one, right? So um, there are three options of road and we need to connect all three of those city and the minimum cost is by choosing this part and this part with total cost of six and we don't need to build um, part one to three with cost six again because those are already connected indirectly right and on the second example we see that um, city one to city two connected with cost of three city four three and four connected with uh, cost of four but um, it will even though we already took all of the option those cities still separated so it's not possible to connect all cities so we should return minus one instead so what is this problem um, main test is like on the how we check the cyclic so if they are already in one group we shouldn't um, create another road and for the cost of the road we want to build we should start from the smallest cost like for example we have three edges here we should start taking the cheapest cost that is this one two to three with cost of one uh, of course while we are building that road we need to check whether two and three is already connected or not so how we going to do that is by using a data structure called this join union set so um, let's take an example here so let's say we have a okay let's say we have three city right like city one city two and city three so when we initialize them actually we say um, city one is on group one city two is on group two and city three is on group three right mm -hmm. and then after that um, let's say we want to merge right so from all all these three option of course the lowest cost is like um, one here right so we should sort them later two to three with cost of one so we take that one two to three with cost of one right we join them together so what this join operation do is like um, two the group is the parent is two three the parent is two right so we just need to make uh, one of them to become the, the parent to become same with the other so parent of three become two right and then it means they are already in the same group and then after that um, we continue one to five one two one to two with cost of five is the second lowest cost so one to two this one uh, it's connected right and then parent of two is two parent of one is one and then we can say okay let's say we follow it parent of two become one right okay parent of two become one so they are connected now but we don't know we already connect all cities so we still iterate through all the possible part right and then one to three with cost of six one to three with cost of six so when we want to merge this one um, we should check like so every time in fact we check like um, the parent of one is one right the parent of one we know is one from this column this table and the parent of three is two right so when we try to find parent in fact we find the parent until the parent is itself so the parent of one is one the parent of two is one right and the parent of three is two but 
how we actually going to find the the find function work like so three the parent is two but two the parent is not itself right it's not two so we try to find the parent of two again which is one and we already found it so parent of three is also one so we update it every time why we update it is because we don't want it L let's say we have we have another node called four right when three want to find the 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 up the greatest parent it go to through in through two, two iteration right and when we want to search for four we don't want to do this iteration again but um we actually changing this part to here so we ask three to point directly to one so next time when we try to find the pet the greatest parent of four it go through three and go through one and directly we can change the part to one again so that's why the find and union the complexity is o n so yeah mm. so uh, after we finish all like all, all the part being merged we just need to check like uh, the the parent of one is one the parent of two is one the parent of three is one and if everybody have the same parent with not one then it means everybody is on the same group already it means every city is connected but if somebody have different parent then it means it's uh, they have different group which means the city is, isn't connected so let's see how it works here so as I said um, I create a th this is the grouping so I create a group of rank uh, for every city so we let's say we have n city we make every city um, the parent is itself the group is itself like one is one two is two and three is three and then we sort all of our connections with the so with the cost ascending so we start from the lowest cost of the path from this three part we start from this one this one and then this one right and then after that we look through all the connections right uh, with the cost uh, let's worry about the this union set letter but if we found like those two node the parent is different it means they are on the different group so this road should be able to merge those two group so we add the cost of uh, merging of the connection the connection array second is the merge is the cost so the cost at we, we add the merging cost and then we join those group like the the group a and group b into one but if they are in the same group already that means we don't we, we don't build that road so that's why the cost is isn't being added up and at the end we just check like after we look through every road and build whatever road we find able to merge two different group then next step is like we find the target of parent zero so it means um, group of not zero and group of the other so if the other didn't have the same group with the first node it means um, all city isn't connected like some city is in the separate group like the second example like um, two the parent is one one is the parent is one but three the parent is three and four the parent is three so they have different group and we should return minus one otherwise we return the cost right so how to check like two two city is in the same group or not so like i said like um to optimize the complexity here like um not for not iterate through this again like if we iterate through like this it will be like every time we want to find a parent it will be um o n right but when we try to find a parent of three we optimize it and when we want to find the parent of four we optimize it and then that means every time the complexity is o one except like the, the the first execution is o n but next time it's like uh, everyone is updated to the greatest parent so um, next time it will be o one like the, the, the cost keep updated so it's not every time o n just uh, that one time of finding certain node so if we t need that node again it will be o one right and yeah so this find parent if you see uh, the recursion 
if the parent is not itself like we we try to find it until like um one parent is one is itself so if as long as it's not itself then we keep try to find the parent of its parent and the catch i'm talking about is we assign the rank p like the the current node let's say the the node 4 now the parent of node 3 is 1 so parent of node 4 is parent of node 3 so here find parent of its parent and the greatest parent of its parent become its parent and then we return its parent and here the update catch is very important otherwise every time we execute we will end up with a uh, worst case of on and union is very straightforward so if you have two city you want to merge it you simply merge the parent of b city b and parent of city a together and next time when we try to find it will optimize by itself right so um, overall this checking will only cost o n and every time we we try to find the same parent it costs o one yeah so that's it about this question thank you for watching see you on the next weekly contest